Hello friends, I'm Ellie, welcome to Cardboard Design. Now, I will build a large house with four rooms and a slide for Queen Elsa. Let's build it together. First, I'll need to prepare some pieces of lilac foam and blue paper. Join them together and secure them with glue to ensure our house frame is sturdy. Be very careful so they don't collapse. Attach some gemstone strings to make the house even more dazzling. Next, I'll start with the bedroom. I'm going to make her a beautiful bed. Join the pieces of cardboard together and wrap them with sparkling paper. Place it here and continue with the mattress on top. I'll stuff it with cotton and wrap it in velvet to make it soft. Glue around it so the cotton doesn't fall out. Don't forget to decorate it. I'll use ribbons and gemstone strings. Whee! Place it on top. Pillows are also essential. I'll secure one end of this fabric and stuff it with cotton. Secure the other end. the middle and we'll have a pretty bow. The surroundings will be decorated. Attach a bunch of gems here. And I'll use these pearls to make the columns around the bed. First, make sure they are securely attached. Create the canopy for the bed using this small piece of cardboard. Wrap lilac paper layers on top and add a large snowflake. Wrap lilac paper layers on top and add a large snowflake. This will be a snow covered canopy. and attach some pretty balls. Add more large snowflakes for decoration. Large ribbon strips with gemstone attachments on top. That's it! I think she'll need a wardrobe to hang her clothes, so I'm making one. Her picture will be pasted on the wardrobe door. Here's the door handle. Add some decoration on top. That's it. Help her hang her clothes inside. Place a rug and a pair of high heels specially made for her. Next to this, I'm going to place a sofa. I'll make a comfortable chair to ensure she feels cozy. It will definitely be covered with the finest fabric. Assemble the parts together, and, of course, they have to be decorated to be appealing. Attach some gemstones on top to make the chair look luxurious. Padding 
for the chair is also necessary. It will need to be stuffed with cotton for comfort. I think she might need a work desk. I'll make one quickly. Wait for me a bit. Don't forget to decorate it beautifully. With this clay, I'll create a classic style table lamp. It will fit this room very well. The last body will be made of gemstone. Add some decoration on top. That's it. Place a few books here. This room downstairs will be a bathroom. I'm joining these plastic pieces to create a shelf for her things. Arrange the items. Place a table here. A wash basin from clay. Install a faucet. I'm sure it's an essential item in every home. This box will be a part of a toilet. Secure these paper pieces together. Create a lid. Decorate it a bit more. Place it here. The bathroom is complete. I'll make a large slide with these foam pieces. Attach them together. Put it in the house. We need to add a guardrail for safety. Don't forget the sparkling gems to make our house even more charming. I already have a table with a microwave oven and a cabinet here. I'm finishing the tabletop. And a gas stove. Decorate with a vase of flowers. Arrange everything. And an upper cabinet for storage. But I almost forgot the chairs. You won't want to stand for too long. Cotton will still be used to create a sense of comfort. An old bottle cap will be upcycled to make the chair legs. Attach them together and decorate a bit. Place them here and here. And everything is complete. Let's take another look at the house.
friend of mine said she wants a house like Queen Elsa's. So today, I've decided to help my friend build a house just like that. Let's see how I'm going to do it. I think we'll need a lot of blue paper. Combine them with cardboard to make a sturdy house frame. Remember to wrap the edges carefully. I'm going to make a wardrobe to place in the corner over there. I think she'll need it to hang her clothes. Make a sturdy clothes rail to hang items. Assemble to wardrobe doors. Here's our door handle. Attach them here. That's it. Place it here. Hello. Do you have a dress to wear to the party yet? A little decoration to make the dress even more dazzling. Just a bit more to go. Add some glittering gems. Looks amazing, doesn't it? I also have two bags here. Let's continue building the house. The door frame also needs to be magnificent. I plan to create a big, luxurious bed in the middle of the room. This will be the bed's frame. It must be very sturdy, so I'll glue it carefully. The upper part of the bed will have a soft cushion and be wrapped in velvet on the outside. I'm sure my friend will love it. The headboard will be made from this cardboard. Add some lilac foam pieces on top. Attach some large, sparkling gems. Looks very elegant. This fluffy comforter will keep her warm during the night. I'll add a bit more decoration to make it suit the beautiful bed. Ribbon. Combine it with a plaid fabric. Attach some gems. It looks lovely. She'll need some pillows too. I'm making them with cotton and fabric. Secure one end, then stuff with cotton. Secure the remaining end and add some border decoration. Would you like to try making one? This will be a special bow shaped pillow that I'm gifting her. The rest of the bed will be here. Can you guess what I'm going to do next? I have a piece of foam here and I'm drawing a crown. here and decorate it. I also have some tool to use as the princess's curtain. Secure it carefully. Don't forget these beautiful ribbons. Finally, let's put these on the wall. Over here, I'm going to make a vanity table. This is definitely an important area. I have some cardboard here. 
and I'm assembling them with foam pieces. The table will have two small drawers to store important items. Here's the table top. It also needs to be wrapped carefully. Let's assemble them. I'll use the steel wire to make the table legs. Slightly bend it. Attach them together. The vanity table should have a mirror. I'm going to make a big mirror here. Of course, it needs some glamorous decoration. Place it here, at a chair. Arrange her belongings. That's the upstairs done. I'm dedicating one room downstairs to display something very special. I'm going to start making it now. I have some premium materials here, and I'm making a huge dress. These materials are quite hard to find, and it took me a long time to prepare them. When combined, we have an amazing product. Add some external decoration to the dress. Some sparkling gems to make the dress look more splendid. Finally, add some ribbons. That's it. Wow! Looks so dazzling. On this side, I'm going to create a grand staircase. They also need to be grand to match this house. I'll recycle some straws to make the stair railings. Attach some pearls to them. That's it. In the final room, I'll place a large bench. I'm going to make it in the style of Queen Elsa's bench. Wrap it in velvet. Assemble these parts and add some decoration. Don't forget the gems. I'll make some big ice blocks around. Everything is done. Let's take one more look at the house. Oh! <gasps> oh, 
start building a mini palace for the beautiful Queen Elsa. What do you think about this idea? Let's see how I will make it happen. First, I need to prepare large sheets of cardboard. I'll assemble them together and cover the top with blue paper. Make sure we glue them carefully to ensure the structure of our palace is sturdy. The design of this palace is quite complex, so I need to be extra careful. Now, I'll start with the first room, which is the kitchen. I'll assemble cardboard pieces and cover them with colored paper. These pearls will serve as the door handles. There we go. Place it here, and we'll continue with the top part. I'll use fake stone paper to make it look more real. Be sure to wrap it carefully. I have a vase of flowers here. This small plastic box will be the stove. Attach a switch. There we go. I think she'll need a refrigerator to store food. I'll make one using recycled cardboard and colored paper. Follow along with me. Make sure to glue it carefully. This will be a refrigerator door. and I'll decorate it with a picture of Elsa on the outside. This is the door handle. Place it here. I'm making her a dining table. The tabletop will be white for a cleaner look. I'll use this foam piece to create the table's legs. Roll it and glue it. Add some snowflakes for decoration. Attach another picture. I have some pictures of the queen here. And I'll make a painting to hang on the wall. A friend of mine sent me two chairs, so I'll place them here. This room is now complete. Next, I'll continue with the room above, but first, I need to finish the floor. I think she has a lot of clothes, so she'll probably need a large wardrobe. I'll make one for her. This is the wardrobe door, which I'll cover in pink paper. And attach a picture of her on the outside. And this will be the door handle. Place it here. I'll make her a few dresses. Go. Wow! They look beautiful. I'll put a vanity next to it. Assemble these cardboard pieces and decorate around it. Don't forget to add some sparkling stones to make it more glamorous.
A mirror is a must, and I'll make one. Add some glittery string around. Can't forget the shiny stones. There we go. Wow. Put some items on top. Add a chair. I have a piece of cardboard here, and I have an idea for it. I'll turn it into a crown-shaped headboard. Attach blue paper on top. Decorate it with gemstones. Wow! There we go. <gasps> the bed frame will be simple. For the top part, I'll add cushioning and cover it with soft fabric for comfort. Glue the edges to keep the cushioning in place. Don't forget to decorate it. I'll use ribbons and gemstones. Place it on top. And, of course, she'll need some pillows. I'll make them quickly. Attach one end, stuff it with filling, secure the other end, and tie a beautiful ribbon around it. Add a large gemstone. Now, we've got a lovely pillow here. Add a rug. This upper level room is complete. In this small room, I'll create a bathroom. Ding, ding, ding. I'm recycling this small plastic box to make a bathtub. Wrap foam around it and add gemstones for decoration. Attach a water faucet. Next is the toilet. Wait for a moment, I'll make it quickly. Place it here. Install a staircase to move between the two levels. This outer room will be the living room. I'll need a large sofa. Assemble these cardboard pieces and cover them with fabric for comfort. Cut away the excess. Attach the different parts. Add gemstones for a more appealing look. There we go. Just a little more, and we'll be done. I'll make another table. Attach gems around it. Decorate it with a snowflake on top. The chair legs will be recycled from bottle cap. There we go. Add another painting. Complete the remaining part. There we go. Let's take one more look around the palette. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to subscribe to see more videos. Goodbye. See you again. Oh, that's a chicken. A bird. 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 A